morning! I'm Good Eager and you may know me for super cutting NL subscriber stream, counting Quiplash memes and making some intros. This is an update video after the Fallout 3 playthrough ended quickly and abruptly. Now for the question, which series shall I do next? There are four options, Life is Strange, Ultimate Chicken Horse, Pintorio and the next substream, which was presumably going to be Undertale. It wasn't. The decision to play Life is Strange is based on the success of Until Dawn, which was brilliant to the point it didn't need a supercut. But Life is Strange from my memory was much longer and less dense, so there is quite a bit of irrelevant filler in the game, and I thought it may be prudent to cut that right out. I was pretty wrong. Many people thought it was also not gonna be on YouTube, which would bump up the usefulness of my interference by a certain margin. But it will be, according to a tweet. So, does the world need a Life is Strange supercut? Would the community benefit enough from it? After watching it myself, I think no. The next choice is between starting to sift through the very long and meme-rich UCH series in order to pick out all the sweet origin stories of memes and metas, or should I dive into Pintorio segments much like Quiplash? Quip and Pintorio fill the same niche on the NLSS dockets in providing a creative ground for humor as well as being low concentration to give mental space for banter. Both UCH and Pintorio would also be good because they are not fresh in people's minds, and a return to their early days would allow to experience some great moments as if it were the first time. Now, about the current substreams. Right now, the only real reason for me to edit them is to save one and a half to two hours per week to people with busy schedules. I'm not sure that this is meaningful enough. So, I think I should dial back and not recycle the series that are going on right now. Especially when they are uploaded to YouTube like normal videos. So, should I continue staying current? Or hold back and start the UCH and Pinterel series that I have been planning since forever ago? Now, a comment about Undertale. I did watch Nick's Undertale series last week and there was a lot of downtime and beating against the wall in certain puzzles and fights. Look no further than the very first boss. So, if Undertale comes, I am cutting it, no questions. But right as I was preparing the text for this update video, I got an idea. I could brew the two other playthroughs that I watched with NLs and point out some differences in Nick, Bear and Ryan's experience. That is a half-baked idea, but could be fun to try. What do you think? To wrap up, 1. Does the world need a Life is Strange cut? 2. Should I stay current and go along with LA Noir? 3. Between UCH and Pintorio, which one should I start first? 4. What about that Undertale idea? Thank you everyone for your support, I will continue doing my best to serve as a useful member of the NLSS Circle Jerk Society. Good night. Oh wait a sec. Two common questions. 1. The intro tune is Rogue Legacy second boss sped up. 2. Yes, I know how Roman 4 and 9 look and I choose to instead do it like a prisoner and draw 1 line, 2 line, 3 line, 4 line, cross them with the 5th one and only then bundle these clusters of 5 into Roman numeral letters. I choose to keep it that way for convenience in editing and because I do have an explanation behind it, even if it's a stupid one. Good night.